Hello friends, this is Mohamed Shakil here and in this tutorial series you will be learning how you can design a chair in Kit 5. As you can see the design of the chair over here and let, let, let me switch back to the work file which we are working on and this is our progress. Now let's just uh, design the back support and to do that make sure that you are in the product mode and go for insert new part and click on the uh, okay it's if if this dialog box doesn't appear you need to click on the chair study but already it appeared because i selected that and i've gone for the uh, insert new part okay let's just uh, go ahead you need to input back support that's what i call now click on yes and we've got a new part over here with the name back support let's just get inside this and uh, switch back to the part design workbench where we can start working on it and as I mentioned before the whole design is based on uh, assumptions and uh, it's just uh, by seeing I'm just giving the dimensions and the main intention of the tutorial is to make you understand the design concept and the skill to design whatever you see now let's just select this face and go for the plane create new plane and switch to any of the side views here and go for the offset move it move it this way and place it in such a way that there is a slightest gap between this face you place it somewhere close to this one and come to this particular view the back view and again zoom out and use the move the offsetting is already done you could click on yes but still I'm just placing it this way so that uh, the plane gets placed on wherever we want exactly now what you can do is select this particular plane here and click on the sketch and then make sure that you are in the other view okay now use a circle and click the circle center somewhere here and drag it in such a way that you get a circle a circular arc and uh, pull, pull this a little outside it stays at almost in the center and uh, this much arc would be enough and if you need more you could do a little more arc now create a axis line just somewhere close like this one and select this line here and go for mirror and select this axis here now you could trim out this remaining portion here and just come out now what you can do is uh, you need to create another sketch you could do that uh, by creating a plane and that must be yep it'll be fine just click on OK we've got a plane on the center of that particular curve over there now you could select that particular new plane and go for the sketch and then insert a rectangle or a parallelogram and create a parallelogram like this one and make sure that this axis is parallel to this one right now make sure that this particular point so for getting that point just project this and make it dotted and just select this line and make it dotted again use the dimension select this point and this edge make it midpoint and take this point here and pull it out this way oh okay need to do like this line and this line should be perpendicular right now just 
pull it out this way somewhere like this come out of the sketch and now you could just select this and go for rip command and select this as the guide curve and we got a portion which is going to be providing as a back support and let's see what could be done in the next part of our tutorial if you have any doubt please feel free to comment below the video and please make sure you're subscribed to enjoy more free tutorials thank you so much for watching